Today, students at Bob Jones High School returned to the classroom for the first time since March. While other Madison City schools returned last month, the school held off due to a coronavirus outbreak. Way 31's Max Cohan joins us live from Bob Jones. He spoke with administrators and students about the return. Max, what did you learn? Well, for the past two months, Bob Jones students have been learning virtually, but today all Madison City schools are back for traditional learning now that Bob Jones students are returning. This is, has been a very long awaited day, and we have been so excited to have our kids back, um, even half of them. Monday morning marked the first time students had been in the halls of Bob Jones High School since March. This week, students separated by last names are coming back on a staggered schedule. Principal Sylvia Lambert says about 67% of the school's students have opted to return for traditional learning, and all of them will be back on campus for five days of in person instruction next week. So it has been so exciting to see the kids. Um, well, I was going to say their faces, but everybody is in masks. So to see, I know they're smiling because I can tell they're smiling with their eyes. In addition to masking, the school is taking precautions, including plexiglass dividers and having students eat lunch in their classrooms to keep them spaced out and cleaning numerous times each day. After nine weeks of virtual learning, students like senior Hannah Cleveland say it's great to be face to face with teachers again. I personally am an in person learner, so virtual was just. I was struggling a little bit, but I feel like that just like it just motivates everyone. Like when we get back in class, to be like, oh, like we're actually in class. Like the teachers are actually being able to teach a classroom and not teach a screen. Cleveland says she expects there will be bumps in the road, but it's exciting to be back around other people and see friends. I saw them today and I was like, I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. And they were like, I know. <laughs> In addition to allowing students to reacclimate to traditional learning, Principal Lambert says this week will be a great opportunity for some new students, those freshmen and others who have not had a chance to tour the building yet. Reporting live in Madison, Max Cohan, Way 31 News.